The Pacific Ocean is a source of fun and fish here in Southern California. Make safe choices for you and your family when dealing with the fish you catch. There is documentation of increased health risks associated with eating contaminated fish. The levels of uh, contaminants are very high in the sediments and they accumulate up the food chain. Learn how to identify the five fish you should not consume. In this video, identifying the barracuda. The California barracuda can grow to uh, impressive sizes of, of up to 11 pounds. The long cylindrical shape is a giveaway to that dorsal fins are widely separated and their coloration ranges from a slate gray to blue and the fins will sometimes have a yellowish hue through them. And unlike the white croaker, the black croaker, the top smelt or the jack smelt, they do have very large, very sharp canine teeth and they know how to use them. The reason that they're included on the list is because of what they feed on. And they feed primarily on smelts, on squid and white croaker. While they can process the toxins and the heavy metals, like the other fish do, they don't do so as quickly or as efficiently. They accumulate a lot of uh, fats in the tissue. Unfortunately for us, that's where the contaminants are stored. They don't break down with cooking, and again, it's safer just not to consume barracuda that are collected off of uh, the Palos Verde shelf. These tips brought to you by the Fish Contamination Education Collaborative. The Fish Contamination Education Collaborative was established by the United States Environmental Protection Agency to educate the public about the health risks associated with contaminated fish related to the Palos Verde Shelf Superfund site. Check out our other videos and information at www.pvsfish.org.